Good evening, Rams. I'm Haley Evans with your latest updates on CSU Sports. The Colorado State football team defeated Utah State 31-24 for the third consecutive homecoming victory on Saturday. The Aggies quickly took a lead on the Rams in the first half of the game, scoring 17 points. This put the Rams at a 24-10 disadvantage at halftime. Freshman quarterback Colin Hill had a solid outing against Utah State, throwing just over 200 yards, including two touchdowns, but was pulled out in the third quarter due to a, new in a knee injury. Junior Nick Stevens was put in as the relief, who threw a total of 37 yards. Colorado State completely shut out Utah State the second half. Kevin Davis was a star defensive player for the Rams and caught the interception that locked in the win with 47 seconds left. Davis was named the Defensive Player of the Week in the Mountain West this past Monday. The Rams are now 3-3 on the season heading into this weekend. Colorado State will play nationally ranked and Mountain West leader Boise State at Boise, Idaho at 8-15 on Saturday. CSU's volleyball team remains the only team in the Mountain West Conference that is undefeated. The Rams defeated the University of Nevada Las Vegas in four sets this past Saturday. The Rams took the first two sets by a storm with scores ending in 25-16 and 25-14. CSU had a rough time finishing the sweep, however, allowing the Rebels to take the third set 25-14. The Rams back ba bounced back for the fourth and final set to grab a close 25-21 win, making them 5-0 in conference play. To top off the win, Colorado State Jasmine Hanna received the honor of Mountain West Offensive Player of the Week. This is Hannah's first weekly honor of her career. Colorado State's next home game is this Thursday against the University of Nevada. Serve time is at 7 in the evening. CSU men's soccer, women's soccer team had a nail-binding game resulting in a 1-1 tie against Air Force on Sunday. The Rams' lone goal was scored by sophomore Keisha Ornes. This was her fourth goal of the season. The Falcons played a very aggressive game on Sunday, making a combined total of five red and yellow cards handed out during the play. Air Force Meredith Reisinger received a red card at the 73rd mark after pulling a ram down from a head butting from head butting a ball. Reisinger was given a yellow card just five minutes earlier. Despite Ornez's effort, the Rams had a, are four and one with one tie in conference play. The Rams' next conference game is on Friday at Fresno State in Fresno, California. That's the latest updates for Colorado State sports, but coming up next is the latest in the world of entertainment with Nicole Hines.